All right, fam. It's your man, not really. I'm back with another vlog. Another day getting to another dollar. I just stay in my tandem because I weighed the truck last night. Well, yesterday evening, and uh, I had two. I had more weight on the back than I did the front. Overweight in the back because we only get 35,000 pounds on each axle in the rear. And I was a little over that. So, slid the tandems. I'm within weight and now it is time to get going looking at my map it says I get that 720 on on Google Maps on my truck map router so it says I get that 930 so I get there somewhere in between there I'll get closer to that 720 mark if it ain't no traffic and I don't have to stop for nothing but uh that's it, that's all y'all, it's a heavy ass load. Enjoy the journey. Enjoy the journey. I'll holla at y'all later. Hit that like button, I know it's ready to video. Do it anyway. grinds my gears seems like every time I pick up a trailer there's be flat tires on it and I gotta put air in it so I don't get no fine so I don't I ain't been doing this long enough to see if it's just from other lazy drivers dropped them off with no air or maybe it was a leak if it's lazy drivers which most likely I think it is because every trailer I've picked up so far minus the last one the last one was brand new Brand new tires and everything, so um, so that one was good. But for all the other ones, I had to put air in the tires. The last trailer I had before the last one was uh, I had to do all the tires. And there's no way I refuse to believe it. it just happened like that. I refuse to believe it just happened. You know what I mean? While they were sitting at the warehouse, lazy ass drivers, I bet. Anyway, I just wanted to share that little piece piece of information for you. Which I should say. Killing my time. Killing my time. But now I'm about I'm hooking up to a I'm hooking up to an empty right now. Get ready to take that up to some warehouse, I don't know. Take it up to a warehouse and then I'm off to actually drop this empty. Hook up a full and take that to Florida. So that's why I'll be heading for tomorrow. Anyway, I need my hands. I'll holler later. I don't know if y'all can see me. If you can, I'll probably leave this up. Let's see. GPS say four hours 15 minutes so it's be somewhere in between there if I remember I'll give you a time check right now it's 954 um, if I, like I said if I remember I do a time check when I get there but I ain't making no promises um, I do know I only got like four hours of drive time so once I get there I'm probably gonna have to stay there I ain't even gonna lie to you which is some bullshit 
Uh, but anyway, life of a rookie driver, man. Deal with what you give, deal with, how you deal with it, is all that what's important. So I'll holler later, man. I'll be like talking. Creeping up out of here, being sure not to go over five miles per hour. Because if I do, that goes from off duty to driving. And I only got like 36 minutes left to drive. Now turn right. As far as work, altogether, I got 47 minutes. And it took forever over here at the uh, warehouse where I'm just leaving. Killing my time, man. So I'm hoping this TA truck stop that I'm going to got some parking. If not, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Wish me luck, y'all. Gotta be some. Always gotta be some. My rookie ass. I, this ain't even on me this time, though. I mean, it's like I'm getting booked these loads with little or no time in between. Like, it, like for instance, today, um, it was mad traffic to get to the first stop. And then when I got there, the tires was flat on the, on the trailer, so I had to put air on that motherfucker. That took more time, so it made me late for here. Now I'm running out of time. Plus that long ass drive I had this morning. Anyway, I'll check back in with y'all later. Peace. Pull all the way up. Pull all the way up. Good time, man. I hit damn near every light on the way over to this motherfucker. Minus like three. And it was all city driving, so it was a lot of lights. And this bad boy heavy as hell too, so my pickup is not fast. Look at look at that. Four minutes left on my drive time. Eleven minutes on my day clock. Nick of time, like I told you. I could have got a five for that. Not from the company, but from the um DOT if they call me. My company, oh, you know what? I probably just miss out on a bonus or something if I messed up with the, with the company. Man, nigga time, what I tell you? All right, man. Yeah, that's a very um, suspenseful ending to the, uh, um, 
So my dry out time today. Very eventful day. That's for damn show. Long ass day too, man. I got up early, early. It was like what? One o'clock? Twelve o'clock? I got up at like twelve o'clock to get on the road by one. I didn't have to, but I woke up, my body woke up, so I was up. Oh man. Anyway, thanks for rocking with me, man. Really do appreciate you. Time to relax. I holler. Peace.